According to a tweet posted by the Iranian news agency IRNA on June 12, the Iranian Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps IRGC, ground forces released video footage of a new multi-purpose quadcopter being tested. The new multi-purpose unmanned aerial vehicle called Arbin was seen in the video taking off vertically with a payload and then successfully hitting a target shortly after takeoff. According to Iran's Tasnim news agency, experts from the IRGC's research and self-sufficiency jihad organization have successfully designed, developed, and manufactured a new multi-rotor bomber drone under the Arbin project. With a payload capacity of 7 kilograms, 15.4 pounds, the drone can drop bombs from an altitude of 500 meters, 1,640 feet, above the ground. Additionally, it features vertical takeoff and landing VTOL, capabilities and can simultaneously carry and launch 10 small missiles for engaging multiple targets. Initially introduced in the Iran Aviation Industries Organization's UAV catalog for export, the Arbin quadcopter was advertised last year as a 21 kg drone suitable for intelligence gathering, surveillance, reconnaissance, day and night cargo transportation, and unloading. The catalog mentioned its approximate flight duration of 1 hour, an operational range of 10 km, and maximum cruising speed of 45 km per hour. Recent news reveal that the Arbin project has been transferred from the Iran Aviation Industries Organization to the IRGC's Self-Sufficiency Jihad Organization, accompanied by changes in its intended purpose and technical specifications. The reasons behind the project's transfer from the Iranian state-owned Iran Aviation Industries Organization to the IRGC's Self-Sufficiency Jihad Organization remain undisclosed. Consequently, it is highly probable that the Arbin drones, like other IRGC drones, will be supplied to Shiite groups in the Middle East. Notably, small quadcopters of this type, which have gained popularity during the Ukraine-Russian war, have recently been utilized by terrorist organizations in the Middle East for drug trafficking and offensive operations.